Hey Josh, I just wanted to show you how to use the embed code for uh, from a Facebook post. So let's say you've gone in to get the video that you want off the Facebook post. You're going to click the three dots, click embed, and then you're going to copy the code. And then in the website, you're going to create a blog post, uh, title your blog post, and then down here in this box, um, you want to click the text tab over here. There's a visual tab and a text tab. You want to make sure you're on the text tab. And then you're going to paste in your code. Now, you need to add one thing to each end of the code. At the front, do the little caret thing and put the word center and then a closed caret. I don't know what that's actually called. So I could be using the wrong term. And at the end, you want to do a, a caret slash center caret. That just centers the video on the page. And when you click back to visual, once that's done, you'll see that the video is there and it's centered. Next thing you're going to do is go down to Taste Test Tuesday and check mark that. If you also want it to go in trending, you can check that as well. Okay. Next, you're going to go down to Featured Media. Um, I'm going to remove this just so you can see. You're going to set Featured Media. You do need an image to represent the post. You know, it'll show up on social, it'll show up on the website. Um, I took a screenshot of you in the video to represent the video. That's um, the best thing because then it can be different every video. If you need help with that, let me know. Then you hit insert. Um, I set it for no image. That way this image doesn't show up on top of the video in the actual post. It's just really for social sharing and for the listing and trending and that sort of thing. And then finally at the bottom in mini site header you're going to want to click 104.5 WFMB and then um, decide when you want it to be published and click update or publish. I'm sorry I had already done this that's why it's on update but you would click publish. So now if I open that in a new tab you'll see there's your post. Josh goes shopping at Ruler Foods and it should be in the trending section. There it is. And now it will also show up on the Josh page. So I've created a Taste Test Tuesday section on your page. If you click this link or this link at the bottom here, those will take you to a Taste Test Tuesday only page um, that will have, you know, once you have multiple videos, they'll be listed and people can go and look at past videos if they want. Also, um, I created this sort of header image. Um, if you share this Taste Test Tuesday page on social, this is the image that will pop up. I love it. It looks so good. I think um, I love the picture that you sent. So I think it looks really, really good. Um, so back here on the Josh page, um, I've set it to show the three most recent videos. So once you have two more videos, they'll be stacked here uh, with the most recent at the top. But this link will always exist under them. And this, of course, is always clickable uh, above them so people can get to the full list. So only the three most recent will show up here.